Thomas Brooks, uh, who's collected works The Banner of Truth publishes in six beautiful volumes, uh, was uh, one of the most popular of the Puritan writers. Uh, somebody said of Brooks that he contained a whole body of divinity in his head and the power of it in his heart. And this comes out, I think, rather marvelously in the pages of these six volumes. Perhaps his uh, most read work today uh, is here in the first volume, Precious Remedies Against Satan's Devices. And it is one of those books I think you can say to people, this is a book every Christian should have and from time to time should read. It's the kind of book you can actually dip into because he goes through the various devices of Satan. Uh, he shows us the gospel remedies and the gospel defense for them. But he only has so many devices. And Brooks ransacks scripture and deals with them as a, as a minister, as a pastor, in a way that's bound to help any Christian who reads the little book. Um, one of the fascinating things about Brooks is that uh, when, when he left his congregation, he was ousted, of course, from his congregation in uh, the, the period of the difficulties that the Puritans had. He gave them some counsel. And almost in a few throwaway remarks, he gets to the heart of the Christian life. And you sense then in these counsels that he gives to his congregation that here is a man who both knew the gospel and knew the human heart. And almost anywhere you turn in Brooks' works, you will find something that really speaks to your need. There's a, a lovely uh, study in volume one of Psalm 39.9 when he speaks about the mute Christian under the rod and how to, how to experience afflictions in a way that will bring glory to God. So six volumes of Thomas Brooks published by the Banner of Truth Trust.